But we want to know what the worst thing he's done. It's the collapse of the separation of powers. He's gobbling up and grabbing all the power for the presidency for unelected bureaucrats, and we're going to stop him. our founders gave us was that they divided the power. We're supposed to have co-equal branches of government and Madison said we would put pit ambition against ambition. The ambition of Congress to try to get more power against the president to try to get more power against the judiciary and they would check and balance each other. Hadn't been working so well for us. This president got defeated in the Congress, in the House, and in the Senate. Now he says, I've got my phone, I've got my pen, I'm just gonna do whatever the hell I want. That's a problem. Montesquieu described it this way. Montesquieu was one of the philosophers that our founders looked to and helped us to come up with the idea of co-equal branches. Montesquieu said that when the executive, the president, when the executive begins to legislate, a form of tyranny will ensue. That's what we're facing, my friends. We're facing a form of tyranny. We won't call him a tyrant, all right. We won't go there. But the thing is, is this is the fear when so much power gravitates into the hands of one person. And it's not just this president. It happened with previous presidents. When you got a Republican president, Republican Congress, they say, give him more power. That's our guy, our gal, give him more power.